Hi everyone, welcome to Apple Tech page. Lot of iPhone 14 series users are reporting that they could not activate iMessage and FaceTime. It shows activation unsuccessful or waiting for activation for both iMessage and FaceTime. In this video, I will show you how to fix this issue. Solution 1 is turn on airplane mode and turn it off. Launch settings app. Now enable airplane mode, wait for 30 seconds and disable it. Second solution is check your date and time settings. For that go to settings app. Next tap on general. Tap on date and time. Make sure that date and time is set to correct. If it's wrong, set them. If everything is correct, turn off and on set automatically. Solution 3 is turn off iMessage and FaceTime and turn them back on. To do this, go to settings app. Scroll down to find iMessage and tap it. Now turn off iMessage then go back. Tap on FaceTime and turn it off then go back and tap general to reboot your device. Scroll down to bottom and tap on shutdown. Turn off your device by dragging the slide to power off slider to right side. Wait for a minute and turn your device back on. Now turn on iMessage and FaceTime. Solution 4 is Reset Network Settings. Resetting the network settings resets your Wi-Fi networks and passwords, APN and VPN settings and cellular settings. To do this, go to Settings app. Tap on General. Scroll down to bottom and tap on transfer or reset iPhone. Tap reset. Select reset network settings. Next enter your iPhone's passcode. Tap reset network settings to confirm this process. Solution 5 is first restart your iPhone. Quickly press and release the volume up button. Next, quickly press and release the volume down button. Finally, press and hold the side or power button until the Apple logo appears. Solution 6 is check for iOS update. Updating your iPhone to latest version of iOS update may solve this issue. To check, go to settings app. Tap on General. Tap Software Update. If new version of iOS update is available, download and install it. Thanks for watching this video. Do like, share, and subscribe to Apple Tech page.